My name is Doug, and this is Leaving the Dream. On October 5th, 2021, Hawaii's very own Sam Kapoi was sentenced to 18 years behind bars in a federal prison with only four days left as a free man. Sam sat down with me in an exclusive four-hour interview that you can only find right here on Leaving the Dream. This is Sam's only interview, and he holds nothing back. So here's Sam's story in his own words. From the ashes, I will rise. No satisfaction without the fight. A man has limits, or so they say. But I never listen. Did it my way. I'm gonna take what's mine. I paid my dues. I dare you to walk a mile in these shoes. To be my soul just keeps getting louder. Give me some of that power. Well, Sam, say what you will. This is honesty. You manned up and you told your story. You owned it. And that's how you heal. Yeah. And that's how Hawaii heals. So I thank you for that. I don't know when I'm going to release this great because i gotta edit and stuff like that um i'm only gonna edit out the things that you asked me to you know what i mean Mm -hmm. um i want this to be like real and raw it's very long but it's worth it i think this may be the most important video i've ever made because it tells a more complete story than any video i've ever made and i think more people will relate to it i think more people will learn from it than any video i've ever made I think more good will come from this video than any video I've ever made. And so personally, I want to thank you Um, personally for me, like it's an honor um, to have this kind of honesty and man to man talk. I've had this kind of talk many times in Hawaii. It's like almost par for the course, to be honest, Mm -hmm. the people that I've arrested in Hawaii, it's one thing about Hawaii. Like I, they, they own it. It's just something that I'm always in awe of and I appreciate and I respect. And so I think that you um, really personified that today. And so I just wanted to get that out of the way and say, thank you. I appreciate you. And that is respect. You earned my respect today. Your time of freedom is ending as you know it. That will be its own time. You will have another chance. You can, you'll still have your kids and your wife and you still can communicate with them and and watch them grow. But like, we don't know how much time we have. And so I think it's a lesson we can all learn from. I don't have to get on a plane in two days. So I don't want the last words of this video to be me. I'll open up the floor to you. Last words. I mean, anything that you want to say? A big part of how I was dealing with all my anxieties and paranoias this entire time since my conviction um, has been with my therapist, um, and, you know, Moana Gasper, she's, uh, amazing. Talked me, walked me through a bunch of stuff from dealing with my current situation, marriage, kids, all that stuff, like mentally and somewhat spiritually, for sure. I attribute like a lot of thanks, I guess, you know, to her for, for making me who I am today because that was a big part of this whole journey was, was that mental trip. So yeah, mahalo to her big time. Mahalo to you, bro, uh, for piquing my interest by, by just doing the, that simple video that I've seen on uh, just talking about me, which uh, got me to reach out. And of, of course I thought about it <clears throat> for a while and, um, I just felt like I had to, you know, because your reach, you know, people is that, that subscribe to your channel want to know the, they call them the T nowadays. Eh? But, um, and I figure this would be like the best platform for uh, share because like I said before, like, there's many people that reached out, many outlets that tried to reach out and I denied them all. Um, 
but for some reason the I just connected with what you were saying and wanted to share and just talk story. So, um, and then to Hawaii, simply just wanted to apologize to for letting letting down the people that looked up to me. Honestly, that's like the the roughest part. Um, because I understand the, the influence that I have or had. And yeah, sorry for letting you guys down right now. And I hope that from this, that I can gain some kind of uh, forgiveness from whoever has that ill feelings to uh, let me rebuild that because if you truly know me then you truly know my character and so I um, I can only ask for forgiveness and apologize for what I've done especially to the people that I've affected directly with uh, the things that I've done to get here so uh, it's not goodbye but is I see you later, whenever that time is, um, and whenever I get back, because uh, there's many, many more things to do um, in my lifetime that I that I know I want to accomplish uh, for our people, especially for our, our place here in in Waianae. So, with that. Um, just aloha nui to everybody and yeah, see you soon. Aloha, Sam. Mahalo, bro. Dear mama, something's wrong. It's cold for a summer night. I feel there's something far beyond what is in my sight I don't know if we're safe here I don't think we should stay here Dear mama, something's wrong It's cold for a summer night There must be something in the water That's making us so